President Joe Biden's decision to issue a comprehensive pardon for his son, Hunter Biden, has ignited a firestorm of criticism from both sides of the aisle. The pardon covers all federal offenses Hunter may have committed between 2014 and 2024, including tax evasion and firearm violations. Democrats like Colorado Governor Jared Polis voice their disappointment, calling it a move that puts family ahead of country. Representative Greg Stanton echoed the sentiment, emphasizing that Hunter's conviction was not politically motivated, but based on felonies proven in court. Republicans, unsurprisingly, have been even more vocal. President-elect Donald Trump blasted the pardon as an abuse and miscarriage of justice, arguing that it undermines trust in the impartiality of the justice system. The controversy raises serious ethical questions about the power of presidential pardons and their impact on justice and accountability. Defending his decision, President Biden stated that Hunter was selectively and unfairly prosecuted, hoping Americans would empathize with his rationale. Yet this explanation has done little to ease bipartisan concerns about the precedent. This pardon sets for future administrations. What's your take on this polarizing move? Does it reflect loyalty to family or a breach of justice? Share your thoughts below. If you enjoy patriotic news and updates, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to stay informed.